एंड वेलकम टू स्टाइन साइड न्यूज टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू शेयर ताशा के आर व्यूज कारी बी डिन डिस अप्रूव प्रोस्टिट्यूट एंड एच पी वी क्लेम्स डिमांड्स न्यू ट्रायल ताशा के हैज बीन फाउंड गिल्टी ऑफ दी फेमिनेशन प्राइवेसी इन्वेजन एंड इंटेंशनल इन्फ्लिक्शन ऑफ इमोशनल डिस्ट्रेस एज पार्ट ऑफ द लॉ सूट ब्रॉड बाई कारी बी ताशा के इज कॉन्टिन्यूंग टू परस्यू अर सेकेंड ट्रायल फॉलोइंग हर लॉस इन हर केस अगेंस्ट कारी बी Based on report records obtained by All Hip Hop, the vlogger asserts that Cardi B failed to disapprove allegation of prostitution or HPV during their court fight. This year, the jury determined Tasha K guilty of defamation, privacy of invasion, and deliberate infliction or emotional distress. Cardi B claims were based on six statements, which she allegedly were defamatory. Tasha K lawyer Olga. Wrote, however, plaintiff failed to show, using strong and convincing evidence, that the defendant published one of those statements without malicious intent. The essence of plaintiff testimony was her assertion that the statement she made were not factual. That the 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 defendant also presented an area of evidence proving the motivation behind each of the statement, and also proving that the defendant didn't act with malicious intent. Tasha K, who is all actually Latasha K B, claims that a judge influenced the trial to Cardi B's favor. Lawyer for Tasha K claimed that the judge was wrongly preventing correct evidence from being shown to jurors. At trial, the defendant were prohibited from presenting evidence of Cardi B's correct and specific instances of plaintiff's conduct. even though under georgia law when there is an assertion of damage to reputation like in this case plaintiff character is substantively at issue isma yalova said the district court incorrect disqualification of evidence regarding the character of plaintiff resulted in an in unbalanced presentation of evidence to the jury the jury did not know the nature of behavior plaintiff engaged in or the person The plaintiff really is an individual and a person. The jury gave a verdict of general appeal for the plaintiff and both defendants. Ismail Lowa defense Cardi B never proved Tasha K made any statement with real motives of malice. The cl- lawyer claims that the vlogger has provided a plethora of evidence citing the source of her accusation, including claims of prostitution and use of drugs. Miss K B said that when she claimed that Cardi B. was prostitute she believed it to be true since miss elmanzer has appeared in a variety of videos throughout career announcing that she was prostitute and performing techniques is melova wrote the defendant proved that miss kb did not act with actual malice when miss kb said plaintiff was a prostitute plaintiff cannot prevail on the defamation defamation claim with that statement tasha ke attorney also spoke to her client making allegation of cardi b being a victim of stds miss kb has not ever stated that cardi b suffers from herpes jenny charlies and there were no evidence to support this kind of statement was offered in the trial ismailova wrote when asked whether jones said plaintiff had herpes miss kb clarified all source to be exact the lawyer went on to say miss kb admitted that when she stated that plaintiff has cold sores or herpes she is basing this assertion on the following fact the definition of cold sores being an infection of the herpes simplex virus on the lips border the lips a video that she, she miss kb believe she heard plaintiff confess that she had cold sores photos showing plaintiff who had cold sores on the lips photos of the husband of plaintiff with lip sores that are cold many tweets from 2015 that claim that plaintiff has herpes or cold sores and hearing other celebrities claim that plaintiff has cold sores or herpes and knowing that these photos and tweet as well as statements published prior to john interview john interview remain accessible to the public and that plaintiff has had never issued anyone who made the statement for the defamation tasha k is seeking a fresh trial claiming that the jury wrongly found her guilty of defamation as well as invasion of privacy her lawyers say that initial ruling must be reversed in its entirely and that evidence of character should be considered in the event of a trial again if you like the video kindly like comment share and subscribe I'm not afraid.